Welcome back to another video. In this video, I'm going to be using this Young Nails Fiber Gel for my Gel X extension. So a little bit about this Fiber Gel, if this is your first time seeing it. This is a gel product from Young Nails and it includes keratin so it can help make your natural nail stronger. This can be used as a somewhat as a builder gel and you can also use it for a gel x extension it has great staying abilities and they have three beautiful colors the one i'm going to be using now is this beautiful pink color this is their original color they also have a cover nude and a soft white color which i have a video on on my channel in a previous video as well so this is the color i'm going to be using it is pretty translucent it is a beautiful nude shade with a slight pink tone to it and we're gonna be trying trying it out we're gonna see uh, the application of it I've only tried it out once um, but it was not this color I did use the cover nude and I used a little bit too much so let's try to use it correctly this time I'm gonna use the nails cat cat square nails and this is size 2 for my thumb so I'm just going to measure it and make sure that it is fitting from side to side and yeah this is the nail that the nail size that I usually use on my thumb so let's get going with prepping the nail uh, I already prepped my my thumb my real nail so just make sure that you are cleaning it off good so before I prep the nail, I'm going to be using a sanding band to prep it. Before I, I prep the nail, I'm going to mark on the outer part of the nail where up to where I need to actually prep the, the tip. So that way I'm not prepping too much of it because you'll see at the end once it's done, I don't like when it shows too much of the prepped. It, it's just not necessary and it doesn't look clean even if you're doing like a um a design where you kind of see through the nail you don't want to see through you don't want to see that the etched part if it's not necessary so i'm just going to etch what i need and then uh, we're going to go ahead and apply it so i'm using my regular e-file and a medium grit sanding band and i'm just going to prep the nail now I've used ceramic bits, I've used carbide bits, and I've used sanding bands to prep the nail, and I find that they're all pretty good. It really depends on the size of the nail. If you're used doing a pinky and you have a very, very small nail, you might want to use like a little carbide bit to really get in there, but since I'm doing my thumb, it's going to be pretty easy. So since I had already prepped my natural nail with the sanding band, I'm just going to prep the, the tip with the sanding band too. So I didn't have to pull a bunch of different products out. I just used what I had. So I'm just making sure that I am prepping the, the nail tip correctly because we want the best adhesion. Now, now that my nail is already on, I feel like it is it's going to stay on pretty well. So um, stay to the end where you can see the finished product. And let me know what you think. Let me know what product you use. My previous video, I did do these same nails. And I did them with the Beatles gel, nail gel, nail glue gel. Um, but this one, of course, I'm going to be using the, uh, the Young Nails Fiber Gel with keratin. This is the cover pink color or their original color because they have a total of three like I mentioned earlier. So yeah, um, looks pretty good to me. We don't have extra etching on it. Now we're gonna go ahead and fully prep the nail so that we can get ready to roll. So I'm gonna use the Young Nail Swipe and my little brush here. And I'm just going to, so already, the only thing I did was clean up my cuticle a bit with some nippers and then I used my sanding band on my nail because uh, I had like some hair dye on it so i just wanted to take that off and then now i'm just going to use the swipe to really just clean up and make sure that everything is off of my nail and you can see how it slowly turns into like a whitish color once it starts to dry that just means that you know everything is off of the nail and we're ready to go so you can see how it slowly started turning white i love using my valentino bond 
I also really like the Young Nails Protein Bond. Um, I do have another bottle that came with my fiber gel kit, or my fiber nail extensions kit, but I just, I really love using this um, Valentino. It's really easy to use. The bottle is nice and big compared to the Young Nails. It's really small, but anyway, I'm just gonna prep my nail. Now I'm gonna use my fiber gel. And I'm going to do the same technique as I usually do. I'm going to coat the entire nail with a little bit of the product. And you can kind of see the consistency here as I'm painting with it. I'm going to do a little thin layer and then I'm going to pull it at the tip of the nail of the cuticle area. That way we can get some product built up. And I think I timed... I keep saying timed, but I'm trying to say it in Spanish, like lo tantia bien, but I did enough product. I guess I eyeballed, that's the better word. I eyeballed how much product to use, so I think I did pretty good with this exact amount. So I just applied the fiber gel on the entire nail, and then I pulled it at the tip of the nail. And now we're going to apply it. So. I always turn on my little light, which is also from Young Nails, from the fiber gel kit. I'm going to turn on the light, and then I'm going to put on the nail. Now I'm going to start from the bottom, and I'm going to squeeze it up. This one is a little bit thicker, so I actually really like how it applied compared to the Beatles. But I like both, so don't get me wrong. It'd be cool if they had a clear one so that I wouldn't have to use up all of my colored products on something that's not even going to show. So I'm just going to put it underneath the light. And compared to the Beatles, I feel like this one just dried or cured just instantaneously. Sometimes when I'm curing my nails with a flash cure, I'll see that a side is missing to get cured a little bit. So I have to make sure I'm pressing down on the sides of the nails. But with this one, it just, it's, it's stuck. And it was just, it was just so beautiful and easy to do so i'm still making sure that i'm getting the sides of the nails and then curing it completely but it was just super easy and i had no bubbles it wasn't drippy i didn't have any spillage it was just a beautiful application with this and the next nails that i'm going to do on myself um maybe in a week or two i really love these nails i have on now i'm going to do the, all of my nails with this fiber gel so you can see it a little bit better on all of my nails but this is what it looks like so beautiful I love the color it is a really natural pink color it's very strong these tips are very strong too so I'm just loving the outcome I don't know which one I love more beetles or the young nails fiber gel I have to do a little bit more experimentation but um, just let me know which one you which one you like, which one you prefer if you've tried both of them already. Um, I'm going to use the same sanding band. I'm going to just clean around my cuticle area. It's just a habit just to make sure that the nail is nice and smooth at the tip so that when they grow out, they're not super bulky. And um, yeah, you don't have to spend too much time doing this. You're just really making sure that everything is cleaned up and you don't have any bulk at the at the cuticle and if you did have some spillage you know you're cleaning it up as well maybe use a a, a, a carbide bit or a ceramic bit either one I'm, i meant to say ceramic to clean it up a little bit faster but you can also use a sanding band it just it, it depends on what you have uh, ready to use so once this is done i'm just going to dust it off i try to avoid using any alcohol or even the the swipe on the plastic tips because it kind of makes them a little bit foggy so i wanted to avoid that so i just dusted it off with a brush that had nothing on it had a little bit of swipe but not enough to where it coated the actual nail and this is going to be the finished product uh, look how beautiful it looks i'm just going to put some of the um, nail prep on my nail in the cuticle area and then i'm going to paint it and then it's going to be all done I really love the outcome of this, super easy to apply, a little bit thicker than the Beatles gel, so really nice in my opinion. And that's it for this video, thank you so much for watching, leave your comments down below and I'll see you in the next video, peace.